The Browns fumbled an opportunity to reach the playoffs Sunday, and while it was a crushing loss, one Youngstown fan is always excited about the team. Ray Prisby is one of six finalists to be added to the Hall of Fans at the Pro Football Hall of Fame. Today I was talking to him about the nomination. I mean, that's the first regular season game right there. And that's it's a collection of everything that is orange and brown. Ray Prisby has accumulated thousands upon thousands of items. It was started, uh, you know, as a kid collecting football cards. His passion was rejuvenated as an adult when he went to a sports memorabilia show. Prisby's helmet collection dates back to the original 1946 model. It includes the first orange helmet that the Browns were told would show up better on TV when they started playing night games in the 50s. Jim Houston wipes out Darryl Sanders. Ray remembers going to the stadium as a kid and games in the 60s when they would pass out a bobblehead. But the thing about those bobbleheads, though, you would put you would mount them on your, um, your dashboard and they would bobble around for a couple of weeks and then they would just fall apart. Now he owns every Cleveland Browns bobblehead imaginable, including some three feet high. Ray's pride and joy is one room devoted entirely to Jim Brown. Jerseys, programs, footballs, and more. Oh my goodness. He was surprised recently when the Hall of Famer stopped by to see his collection. Well, you know what? He signed a jersey when he was here, so that's probably my new favorite item. He has soda machines with the Browns logo, footballs, and programs from every era, orange guitars to rock out, even a seat from the old stadium. He also has no idea how much he's spent on the collection. You kind of go through phases, and right now I'm into the game used um, jerseys and helmets and cleats and, you know, the, any part of the uniform this game used. Prisby worked at General Motors and spent 11 years in the Air Force. He's retired now, but still has a passion for the Browns, one he hopes will earn him a spot in the Hall of Fans. Probably my love um, for the history. Uh, because, you know, you can go, you can collect, you know, good stuff, but, you know, you got to get that, the bad stuff in there, too, because it's all part of, it's all part of the history. Ray hopes the Browns end a 17-year streak of not making the playoffs Sunday. It's a game against the Steelers you can only see on WKBN 27, and Sunday's all, Sunday is also the day voting starts for the Hall of Fans. I've included a link inside this story on the WKBN app and website so you can help Ray out.